Hi, it's Kylie Koo, and I'm here with day 12 of the ATC challenge, creating an ATC for each day of June. And this is a very quick uh, video today because I actually pulled this card together in under 15 minutes. I think it was around 12 minutes. So I've just pulled out one of these photos from the Tim Holtz photo booth collection. I don't know why I bought these. They've sat and sat and sat, but I'm trying through this challenge to actually use some supplies that have actually sat around for a while or that I haven't used for a little while. So I'm taking this photo and really distressing it up. You know, I just thought back to, you see old photo albums and, uh, you know, rarely are photos pristine. And yeah, I just thought, well, I'm going to distress this up and almost make this sort of little memory board type ATC. You know, imagining this couple and, and some of the things that they might have saved and just pulling them together. So really trying to distress that, going around it with the walnut stain, roughing up the edges, putting the fold down the middle, etc. And these are some other things I've taken from, I think, the Tim Holtz thrift store collection. I think they call it a kind of little pack of ephemera. Again, I don't think I've used anything from that and I've probably had it a year, maybe even two years. So now is the time to use it. So just pulling together bits and pieces. And again, I'm going through that same kind of process of just distressing them, roughing up the edges a bit and putting the walnut stain around them. I think I had one other piece off to the side, but I didn't use it in the end. So now taking the walnut stain and just that applicator thing. Yep, a thing. I don't know what else to call it. That applicator thing and just spreading the ink around it and then just going around the edges at this stage. And I'll do that a couple of times throughout the process. I'm now going to take some water. I'd done this the other day with one of the ATCs and I liked the effect and I thought that that would make quite a nice background. You know, it's almost that sort of thing that when paper sat around for a while, it starts to discolour and, and whatnot. So yeah, I thought that would make a nice background for this. Then just taking some washi tape that music on it and just going over that again, just to kind of knock back the colour of it a little bit. I only added the music because I thought, yeah, I don't know. See old photographs of couples, I always think of music for some reason. So again, just going round the edges and now just looking at how I, I might place these. You know, imagine that ticket, I think it was a cinema ticket, theatre ticket, and just kind of something that might have sat about in someone's pocket for a while. And it comes out all rumpled and then it gets thrown into an old box and maybe at some point gets put together with other little bits and pieces of memorabilia. So now just gluing it down with some uh, gel matte medium. I see this very quick card to pull together, but actually a very enjoyable card. I did really enjoy it. And sometimes it's nice to do things that, that take less time. Just see it coming together really quickly. So deliberately putting the photo slightly off center. I didn't want it right in the middle. I often wonder when I see these kind of photos who it is that's kind of looking back out at them, out at me. It's a nice photo. Look a nice couple. So again, using my chit chat stickers and I've just taking the one memory, so that just seemed to fit so well. I'm just trying to get it positioned. Try not to cover over too much of the music washi tape because I'd already lost a bit of it by covering it up. 
but that's what I settle for. And then I just take a bit more of the Walnut Stain Distress Ink and just touching up some of the edges there. I then take a paint brush because I just want to darken it in a couple of spots, trying to avoid that glitter which came from yesterday's project. And then I just take my finger and go in with that and just use that. Not looking for anything too dark, but just to kind of darken a few spots and over the photograph a, a little bit. And then I go over the uh, chit chat sticker as well. So a nice quick one for today. But as I say, just as enjoyable to make as, as any of the others. So going around a chit chat sticker with pen and that's it. So hope you've enjoyed this one. As always, thanks so much for watching and bye for now.